There are so many research questions to be answered. In the past, antennas are usually made from metals. But these days, those the material properties are very much limited. So there is a one way you could do is to manipulate the material properties from metamaterials. Metamaterials are artificial materials which have a special material properties you cannot find in nature. And this would enable you to redesign a lot of devices and potentially to change the fundamental physics. First of all, you need to create a, a unit element and then you can rearrange that into um, many different periodic patterns. The way in which light usually interacts with matter is defined by the atomic structure of the materials. With metamaterials, we allow for a sub-wavelength structure and this means that the propagation can be more exotic than that of standard materials. No longer does light have to travel on straight ray paths through mediums, but we can allow for curvature of the ray paths or even to bend around particular objects. One of the applications for metamaterials is in mobile phone antenna design. I envisage in the future the antennas in a mobile phone can be made extremely small and maybe conformal to the phone itself. Those materials literally can be fabricated using different technologies, and from chemical etching to inject printing to nano fabrications. What I find most exciting about my research is the fact that we're really changing how technology is moving. In the future, if you look at the cars and planes that we'll have, everything's going to be connected through a high throughput a mobile world. Working with metamaterials is like working with science fiction in the present. You could envision making invisibility cloaks or perfect lenses. And metamaterials are particularly interesting to the public, partly because it's, uh, it's something that is really going to change the future. There's a lot of potential to it. It's just a whole new paradigm in how we approach design and engineering work. The challenge of metamaterial research is a huge gap between the theory and the reality. It's very important to engage the industry users to understand what are the true needs and then try to work out how those new theory can be particularly applied to new industrial applications. I'm personally very interested in metamaterial research. Having engineering background, I'm really interested in how to take those new theory into the practical applications. I'm lucky enough to get education from many uh, antenna and radio pioneers and I would like to pass those knowledge on to the next generation and they are the main force for the future innovation.